So I've been doing some work on this thing. You can see that basically the square there, I've actually welded in this little point all the way around there and welded in all the way around here. Now I've also gone in and I've shaped, I've kind of fine shaped this stuff. You see I've actually used a little uh, hand file into this. I actually used this sander grinder to basically take down and start to create these flats on the ends. The coolant. You'll also notice that this started out as a square head block that came down straight like that. And now I started to meld in where the wit where the uh, using a die grinder. Basically, I'm I'm melding in using my eyeball to try and make them nice and even. Okay, so I'm doing that. You can also see that the base plate I've made into that oval that, that's the shape of the, the original shape of the bottom of that thing. You can see really good in that picture by Oliver Reed. Okay, I've kept it really very flat right here though, so to make sure that my uh, blade sockets in there really well. Now what I'm doing is I'm getting in here now with my die grinders and kind of grinding out this to, to get the uh, the welds off so it looks nice and smooth. I probably also, just to start taking off a little bit of weight on this, I'll probably actually come in there and I'll actually sand this edge here. I will probably also bring the head block down a little bit. It'll probably be just wider than the, the actual uh, handle itself. You can take a look. And I'm actually going to also, I'll probably be modifying the handle too. Most of the time with these handles, I'm actually going to flatten out the sides here. Yes, yeah, so they're a little bit more of an oval rather than they're a perfect circle when you after you lay them. So anyway, I, it's actually starting to look like it could be a sword now. Okay, so uh, so it's a lot of fun. It's just it, it, cleaning up. Most of these swept tilted rapiers, you're gonna spend a good amount of time cleaning up. It's just the way it is. If you want the wells to look good and uh, the way the ones in the actual museums look. You have to get it to the point where you can't see any welds. Back in the Middle Ages, they didn't weld. Uh, they welded uh, using the, uh, the forge. Uh, uh, I'm doing a lot of file work to clean up. Uh, one of the big problems I, I have with, with the rig that I have is I don't really have any of the sanders that uh, are really used a lot in terms of shaping these things. So what I'm using is actually the grinders and a random orbital sander. The random orbital, because it's got a soft pad, tends to uh, take away a little bit of the sharp edge to this. So I usually tend to have to go back in with a file in order to make it look yeah, really sharp. But that's where I'm going.